there and happy birthday autumn and hello party guests. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to be making a light fury paper airplane. The design I came up with a couple years ago when the How to Train Your Dragon 2 was coming out and for my kids I came up with a toothless one with his tail, you know, the tail missing. Um, but it's pretty much the same design uh, just besides uh, the construction paper and the red paper in the back of the tail. This is just normal printer paper. You can get heavier or thicker uh, paper if you want. Um, you can do any color as well. But today we're just use using printer paper. It's a little bit thicker stock, um, but we're going to be using that. We also need some scissors and a glue stick. So let's get to it. So get your normal piece of paper like this, and we're going to fold it in half like a hot dog. like that. You can use a flat surface. I'm not using a flat surface. I'm just folding it in the air. And then we're going to want to take this and we're going to fold it like a triangle into the center. Like this. We're going to do that with the other side as well. like this. Next we're going to bring the tip of it and we're going to bring it down to about maybe an inch towards the bottom. So it's going to look something like this. About an inch from the bottom. And then we're going to do the same thing we did at the top. We're going to take this part and we're going to fold it down towards the center, following that middle crease line. So something like that. And we're going to do the same for this side. So here you should have both sides folded down and there's a little triangle here at the bottom, this little tab, and we're gonna fold that up. So it's gonna look kinda like this. So next, while holding that, we're gonna try to fold it backwards like this in on itself. see it taking shape now where you have that little grippy thing to hold and next we're gonna fold this wing down fold the wing so it's right along that edge at the bottom and then same with the other side Like a tie hit this part. <laughs> we have the basic shape. Now, this tip right here, we're gonna open the plane up like this again, and we're gonna fold that tip back. And then we're gonna fold it back like we did before, back to its normal shape, like so. So now you can hold it, you can open it up, you can see the other little airplane inside. But yeah, this is an old uh, folding trip my dad taught me, that his, uh, his brothers, their uncle, um, handed it down to them. 
So it's a family little airplane thing that we've been doing for many years. I'm carrying on the tradition. So after we use the first piece of paper, we're gonna need another piece of paper to make the tail. This is the part you need the scissors for and the glue stick. So we're gonna take another piece of paper and we're gonna fold it in half like a hot dog again. the design of the tail that we want on this side so when we cut it out you'll have two mirrored sides when you open it up you'll have the tail for both sides and you can draw it out if you want or you can just cut it out it's up to you but you're gonna probably want seven inches from the start to the tip of the tail give or take you can experiment with it whatever works for you So it slips up, goes down, up, and then down again. Now that the piece is out of it, you're gonna hold it up and you wanna cut it sideways like that on the tip so that when you open it, there's that little thing down inside. You can now test fit it and you wanna tuck it, tuck it inside right where that is. Kinda of get a basic measurement of or feel of where you kind of want it now if, like I said if you if you keep it out too far the plane when you, when you try to fly it it'll just fall right down um, so maybe make it a little bit shorter I know their tails are pretty long in the movie so if you want to try to make it a little bit longer out you can and next you're gonna want to glue with some glue sticks or a staple if you don't have glue sticks um, you want to put it on the inside so when you put it in and pinch it, it'll stay there. Alright, so we're gluing, we're gluing the inside of the wing and we're going to slide that in there and pinch. Slide that in there and pinch it. Good, so there you are. There is your Light Fury. And you can design it, you can color it, you can do whatever. You can use different color paper, like I said. In this case, I use construction paper. And I use the, um, the symbol from the, I think the second movie it was from earlier on. They changed it as he got older. Um, same, same thing, same design, same folding. And just be creative with it. But these do fly really, really good. Um, the plane flies really good without the tail as well. It's a nice little trick plane as well. But there you go, there's your How to Train Your Dragon, uh, Night Fury and Light Furies. Enjoy guys, and happy birthday again, Autumn.